Hi. Hello, wonderful investors. My name is Judy. I'm actually a state consultant. Welcome to PU. PU Property Update. Um, first of all, I want to say congratulations, all of us who have made it to 2023. Uh, we want to thank or we want to thank God first for keeping us alive to this moment. We also want to thank you, our dear subscribers, for being supportive. We also want to thank you, our dear friends, who has shown us love this uh, past year. You have done business with us. We want to thank you so much for doing business with us. And we can't take that for granted. We appreciate you so much. And uh, uh, this is 2023, and I want to say, let us do it again this year. There's a lot, a lot of opportunities right now in Lagos that you need to take advantage of. You see, we're going to talk about it in this video, and um, I'm not going to talk about so many products, but there's a particular product that you need to pay attention to right now because of what is actually coming and you are going to be a beneficiary of it if you take this first step to invest in this property. Now, before we proceed, I just want to implore you, I want to urge you to subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell so that anytime we post information like this, you get to see it first hand. Once again, my name is Chidi. I am a luxury listed expert right here in the city of Lagos. I am a lead consultant at Madonna Homes. And also, I'm a member of the Pioneers. Pioneers are real estate experts right here in Lagos. And I'm actually a member of them. Also, I'm also a member of Alvin Gray and Associates. Alvin Gray and Associates is official brokerage for Land Reinvestment Limited. And this year, we take a step further to, to tell you to also um, bring this information to you that we are not going to give you any property that are not verified. So we are going to make sure that we verify the property, get the due diligence, do the due diligence of the property before we push them to you. Okay, all that being said, let's move to this um, topic of today. Now, there's a news in Lagos, a breaking news in Lagos that Port Mayland Bridge Vida has been announced. Please, I would love to play this before we move on. Please watch. And to other matters, the Lagos State Government has announced CCECC and CROCCIG Consortium as the preferred bidder for the proposed Fourth Mayland Bridge project. The bridge will span about 37 kilometers, starting from Abraham Adesoya in Aja on the Etiosa Leki Ekbe corridor through the Lagoon shoreline of the Lagos Ibada Expressway via Ubutu Ishawo in Ikorodu. Correspondent Theophilos Elama gives us more details in this next report. In 2019, the Lagos State Government had called for expression of interest for the construction of the fourth Mainland Bridge project. After rigorous checks, the government opted for CCECC as preferred bidder for the bridge construction. At this briefing, the Lagos State Government gives an update on the plans for the proposed fourth million bridge. It's uh, something that uh, all of us uh, will be proud of, that we will look at uh, in many years to come, that uh, we were part of this project one way or the other. Our preferred bidder, which was evaluated by the contracting authority, which comprised uh, Ministry of Works and Infrastructure, Office of uh, public private partnerships along with uh, project advisors, um, Mrs. Advanced Engineering Consultants, AEC, uh, Mrs. KPMG, uh, Financial Consultants, and uh, our legal advisors, Olani Moja ALP. Features of the bridge include a 37 kilometer road and bridge tolled highway, 5 kilometer length of 2 by 5 lanes Lagoon Bridge, 32 kilometer length of 2 by 4 lanes carriageway. The bridge will have a design speed of 120 kilometers per hour, six interchanges installed initially with three future interchanges, three mainline tour, a BRT corridor and outside lanes, provision for cyclists and pedestrians, as well as provision for rest areas and truck parks. 
about 800 structures will be affected as government says it has a settlement framework mapped out to avoid legal tussle. The government also explains that the bridge will reduce congestion on the existing Carter, Eco and Third Malin bridges while opening new areas of the city for future developments. This is coming after extensive route alignment and survey, 16 to be precise, so 16 route selections were carried out before we eventually arrived at this that has minimal number of demolition that also fits into the resettlement action plan and then also signed off with the environmental um, impact assessment certified by the Federal Ministry of Environment. All right, all right, guys. So that is the news in town. This is a good news for all smart investors. Um, those in Lagos and those outside Lagos. Now, there's a lot of real estate development that will benefit from this development. But for a quick one, before I start giving you orders, for a quick one, you need to start making your first move right now to invest in this property. The name of this estate is Fairmont Green and Smart Garden Estate. And the location is Ibegumeki. Now, why is this property so important that I have to talk about it first? Now, the thing is that this Fort Melan Bridge, one of the wings of this Fort Melan Bridge will come directly to the road leading to this estate. And apart from that, because the estate is facing the proposed uh, international airport, it's, it makes this estate one of the best estates to invest in. These estates will benefit from the airport as well as this Fort Melan Bridge because one of the wings of this, this Fort Melan Bridge is going to join the road that leads to this estate and the airport. So that's one way the estate is going to be benefiting from this uh, Fort Melan Bridge. So now, instead of some people coming to uh, Ibadileke, they rather go through this road and this road will be busy because it's an airport road as well. So that is why you need to make the move right now. This property was launched last year, it was the end of last year, and the property has appreciated. For those who bought this property, the property has appreciated. It is a, a, um, a residential and commercial estate, and it's strategically located where your investment will get a place Don't joke with this investment. I am not for sale to buy, but if you are a smart investor, and you have read that Fort Miller Beach, the wing of Fort Miller Beach will drop on the road that leads to this estate in the Bedulaki. And also, the road leads to uh, International Airport. This should ring a bell. It should be a clarion call to you that the airport will affect this property, the Fort Miller Bridge will affect this property, and the property price will definitely skyrocket within a short period of time. And that is what land in the is all about. Now, this property is a green and smart estate, and it's going to be facing a uh, airport. And what are the features of this estate? The features of this estate are it's going to be a solar powered estate. So that's why you see smart estate. And also, it's going to have a, a, a recreational center. It's going to also have uh, smart infrastructure. We also have uh, energy, smart energy. We have ele electric car charging dock. We also have uh, renewable technology in this estate and also green area. These are the features of this estate. And this is amazing because if you look at the features of this estate, it has to do with eco friendly ecosystem and everything here will give the resident or those who come or to visit this estate the sense of living in a green and clean environment. And that is what the world is tilting towards right now. So, what are the payment plans of this estate? In this estate, we have only two land sites, which is 300 square meters and 500 square meters. Now, 500 square meters outright payment is 18 million naira. But if you are spreading for six months, it's gonna be 19 million naira. And your initial deposit is one million naira. 
one million naira, you are good to go. But if you are spreading from 12 months, it's gonna be 20 million naira. And if you are spreading for 18 months, it's gonna be 21 million naira. So don't forget, initial deposit is 1 million naira and you can secure your spot in this estate. We are not saying that if you want to pay more than that, in fact, I advise my clients to pay even 50% so that it's easier for them to spread the rest. So, and for the 300 square meters, it's um, the outright payment for it is 11 million naira. And uh, for six months, if you want to spread for six months, it's gonna be 12 million naira. And if you want to spread for 12 months, it's 18 million naira. And if you want to spread for 18 months, it's 14 million naira. And initial deposit is 1 million naira. Now, the title to this property is Government Allocated Sea of Food. Now, it's not just a land that um, you just buy. It's Lagos State Government that gave this plan to this uh, real estate developer. So you can just imagine that government allocated sea of food is what this property is done. So you have nothing to worry about. Like I said, we are doing all our possible best to make sure that we do our due diligence. And the, the real estate company that is selling this property is Landmark Priority Limited, and they are reliable, they are trustworthy. And this is the information I am bringing to you today. Buy Fairmont Green and Smart Estate. Right now, it is selling, and you can be part of uh, investors who have already invested in this property and own a fortune. An investment that will put a lot of money into your pocket. You know that properties that are very close to airport are always appreciating that because there will be a lot of demand and you know demand brings about scarcity and when there is scarcity there will be a lot of increase in price you heard that that is how smart investor think please give me a call and we can start you know uh the business from there give me a call uh, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and uh, we are going to be teaching an amazing amazing investment opportunity for you right here in Lagos. My name is Chidi and I'll see you next time. Bye.